Hey everybody, this is Mr. Alien Freak 49 and we're going to be discussing the difference between a 360 and a 360 Slim. And then we're going to be discussing the difference between a 360 and a Wii. And you're going to post down below in the comments which one you think is the best. Alright? Alright, let's go. Here, I'm showing you the front right here, regular 360, right here, the new 360. Which one do you think's better? I think the smaller one, the more compact one. Now here, first difference, no buttons. This is a button, that's a sensor. You just touch it and it'll come on. Same with that, same with that. You still got your two uh, USB ports in the front. Still got your two right there. Uh, I'm not sure where the sync button is. I think they still got memory on them right there. Uh, anyways, well, uh, very awesome. Uh, nice chrome up there, not bulky memory card. The memory card is actually still right there, but you cannot see it. It's tucked in there. Like, you, uh, take your fingernail, and you pop up one end of it, and it's a little chip, and you gotta, well, not little, I mean, it's pretty bulky, but, and you gotta pull it out, and it comes with the 250, I think, and, uh, this one's big bulky, um, here, we'll switch over now, here's the back one, substantial difference, substantial, here, look at that, power supply, power supply, bigger, way bigger, uh, it's smaller there, it's pretty awesome, and you got your, uh, new, you got your uh, surround sound audio thing right there. Pff, nothing. Still the same. Still the same. Uh, here is for the Wii Connect. You don't have to plug it into the wall anymore if you have this. It, it puts power in and brings it out. Uh, you have the still the same uh, Ethernet hookups and one three this one has five this one has three uh so the new th the new slim has five and the regular has three and uh another thing is look at that that's like an inch and a quarter off it's got a nice new sleek design shiny the controllers are sweet uh i don't personally own one yet but I'm definitely buying one here pretty quickly. Alright, now let's discuss the differences between the Wii and the 360. Here's this. The Wii. Here's the Wii. Pretty awesome. Nice slim. Does a lot of things. Now here you got your disc driver. Got your power, your reset, your this, yeah. Have extra memory slots, extra memory slots, different controller slots right here. So, different controller spots. Uh, mm, very slim. Got two, that's it. It's, uh, and here's your 360. Very, very bulky bigger got a little bit it's got two memory slots uh not a electric uh cd drive thing it's only you get the push button uh button big it's bulkier way compared to that to that big difference but which one plays better which one's better for uh, connections and stuff all right here it's uh has a lot more little hookups and gadgets in on the back god it's got this you cannot change your memory this you cannot change your memory in it but you can add memory to it well, actually, this is for different games. This is for a Nintendo GameCube. So is that. But you can add an SD card to save games, too, with it. Uh, 
Uh, right, we're gonna change. We're gonna say what the faults with this are. Uh, you cannot change memory. You. Uh, this is actually a pretty good game system. It's very slim. I'll say this real quick. Like 360 the fault. Uh, no Wi-Fi. That's one thing. Uh, you can buy a Wi-Fi stick for it, but that's like 80 bucks or something like that. It's a pain. Uh, bulky. Uh, the good thing about it is you have memory, removable memory. You have, it's, it's, here's another fault with it, it's loud, very loud, and, uh, this, fairly quiet, uh, I think the 360, compared to the Wii, has a little more and more graphics, um, we'll compare the controllers now, see the differences between them, Wii controller, Here is the 360 controller compared to the Wii controller. Hold on, I'm gonna take the nunchuck off. To the Wii controller. Wii controller, a little bit longer than it. Definitely not as tall. Uh, no joysticks. Uh, you got your power button on it. You got your power button on the controller here. You got a. Uh, pretty much it's all the same except Wii is like it's uh you play it like this and this you actually got a controller I prefer the controller because if you get a uh, weird light rays in here like if your lights are too bright it sucks it won't you gotta no matter how much you adjust it if you play in the dark this mother trucker works so good it's pathetic uh but really bright lights nope but this, you can play in any type of light. It's uh, pretty cool. You can uh, add a whole bunch of kitchies and gadgets to it. And you can change all the lights in it. It's pretty awesome. That's not really what you're talking about. But still, I like the 360 controller over the Wii controller. That's me. So I call one for Sony or one for Microsoft. Uh, we'll go the Wii, the actual system. With the way you can access the internet, 360 you can't, it's got Wi-Fi, I'll say, the Wii goes on it, and the 360, not liking it, except, here's another fault, you can connect a headset to your, uh, 360, and you can, uh, talk to people, send voice messages, talk while you're playing games, Wii, nope, uh, it's a lot easier to add friends on the 360 than the Wii, yeah, uh, I'd say, I'd call it, if I had the 360 Slim, I'd call the 360 Slim better than the Wii. Uh, let's hear what you have to say.